Hey Leo, welcome on my channel, Zipil to Utero. I'm going to do your end of the January 2022 general reading. What and who is coming your way? What's happening in your life next? Love life overall. The view for you, the next um, upcoming days. So keep an open mind. This is a general reading. Take what resonates and leave the rest. You can also book a personal reading. Everything is given in the description box. Sun, moon, arising, any planets if you have in Leo, you can write this reading. You can also switch the energies if you're cross-watcher. Just stick what resonates. It's general, just a general reading, and I'm just reading the vibes here. So energies can be flip. Let's see. What's happening, Leo? Okay. We have eight of pentacles. The hangman. Hmm. Nine of Wands. We have the Eight of Cups. And we have the World. Interesting. Bottom of the deck, we have the Eight of Swords. A lot of Eight here. We have three Eight, 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 Eight. You could, you could be seeing Eight, Eight a lot. The Hermit. Someone left you out in the cold. You feel left out in the cold by someone or someone definitely. It's, it's someone that who left you out in the cold. Someone ghosted you. There's a breakup happen between you and this person or you need to let someone go in, in order to move forward in your life. We have the Eight of Swords energy here. There's a lot of things stuck right now in your life. Okay. You could be going through Dark Knight of a Soul. A lot of you with the Leo energy here. I'm picking up here. Um, you feel like universe is pushing you, but it's not. It's happening. Look at this eight of swords energy. You feel like universe is pushing you, but whatever is going on in your life, it's it's happening for you because this is a divine hand. It's protection. This rejection is protection. This uh, tower moment or whatever is going on in your life right now is a protection for you because I'm seeing this is a divine hand protecting you from something. You're looking for help. But you need to connect with the divine here right now. Nobody will come and help you. You may be asking this person to help you, whoever you are connecting with. The hermit. This is definitely deep soul searching here. A lot of Leos are you going through. Look at this, the hermit and tower. Yes, it's here. It's like your soul searching. Tower movement happened, right? This was mean to happen. This, this, this situation need to fall out. There was no solid foundation between you and this person. For some of you, it could be a breakup that you are definitely going to break up with someone. And you are with this hermit energy like being reclusive, retreat. And there could be some type of, with the eight of swords and tower, it's like, um, there's definitely some type of a tower movement happening for you. This need to happen or already happen in your life. And you could be with the hermit right now is like trying to be Focus on yourself with the Six of Swords, trying to move on from something. It's like fighting with your demons, your inner demons. Fighting with your inner or external demons or whatever the, the circumstances are going on right now. So you're definitely trying, you're moving towards healing with the Six of Pentacles, Six of Swords energy here. Trying to heal. You need to get out of this dark energy. You don't deserve this. You need to connect with the spirit more, with the hermit energy. Go into deep introspection and think about it, what you're doing. There's something that you need to let go from the past. It's just all in your head, maybe, with the eight of swords and tower. It was just all in your head. But you were with the hangman here. It's been, it's been a long time that you were holding on to this situation. And angels are helping you, like, move. Move. Move, my child. Move from this. Angels are helping you, like everything, they're showing you all the flags, red flags, in this situation, in this connection, in this, whatever you're going through. They're helping you, they're telling you, showing you the signs, and you may be seeing a lot of synchronicities or all that stuff. They're telling you that, child, move on. Leave. Stop wasting your time in the tower, and they're pushing your way, it's like... You are definitely, it's like climbing on things, like, it's like you're holding on to this very tightly, like, no. It's my dream with the Eight of Cups here. It's my dream. It's like you are definitely in love in the idea of someone, 
But in reality, that person is not present there. I'm so sorry to say it. This, this is not in reality. This is not happening in reality. It's just, it's just your dream. It's just in your, in your mind. Look at this. It's just a dream that you thought about it like we will be together. We are in love. We were our soulmates. We were soulmates. We were twin flames or whatever you were expecting from this person. But it was just a dream. You're like, no, it's my dream. This person is my, the love of my life. You know, it's just saying, no, move. You are in a toxic relationship. You are in an unhealthy. It's like it's a dream that you're, um, you're just dreaming about this person. With the hermit, look at this. It's just you. You're dreaming about this person. That person even not even present. I feel this could be that person. They're not present there, honey. There, there is not. There, there is no sh sharing the energy with you. There is no talk. Nothing. This person never say a word to you. No expressions. No love. No talking. They maybe ghosted you. But this is someone that who maybe played the mind games with you. They let you on, like yes, I'm into you. But they never make the move. They never come towards you. It's just. A dream it's like this is someone that you were potentially it's like you thought is, is the one for you look at this they look like the same you're idealizing someone they could be living in the different place it's like look at this home so you already planned the home with this person or you were like wow we will be together so this is like a very like a fairy tale romance all in your head so this is definitely gonna break out with the knight of wands here this is someone who is definitely focused on themselves they're all about themselves. You're not present in this person's life. They could be going through their own soul searching right now. But they're focused on themselves. They're focused on their work. They're building themselves. And here you are imagining and dreaming about this person. With the Knight of Wands here, they could be a player, by the way. They definitely led you on with the Knight of Wands energy. But universe is saying, move. Let go of this person. It's very toxic. It's not healthy for you. You are going through a dark night of a soul or vice versa. Maybe they are going through it. But this is definitely uh, a breakup, separation. Moving on, six of swords, moving towards a calmer water, moving towards a peace. This person is giving you anxiety, depression, no answers, no clarity, no truth, nothing, but only a dream. Only a dream. It's, it's hermit. It's, it's, they're not there. You're idealizing them because Hermit is looking for the star. You see them, them as a star. Maybe this is a celebrity or someone uh, you're having a crush on. You are definitely um, already imagining a lot of things with this person. And this person is not, not even there for you. They're not. They're just doing their own stuff. Yeah, with the world card, it could be on internet. It could be on social media. Um, this person is all alone about themselves. You're not even present in this person's life. They're building their future. They're building on themselves. They could be popular and famous on social media. Knight of Wands, definitely they led you on. Are you seeing them a potential partner? Look at this, how sexy this person looks, right? Doesn't matter male or guy, but this is men, right? Manly energy here, masculine. So they're very attractive. So you're idealizing, this is my lover. This is my soulmate. This is my twin. No, honey, they're not present. Two of Cups is missing. This is Eight of Cups. This is eight of cups, two of cups missing. It's not equal give and take. It's not equal give and take. Unfortunately, eight of cups next that the world card. You need to complete the cycle. You need to live in the reality, ground your energy. Focus on yourself. Look at this eight of pentacles. You need to ground your energy. You need to focus on building on your own future. You need to focus on building. Uh, that's why it's not working with a hangman here. It's not working. You're still holding on to this person that one day they will come and your dream will come true. But universe is telling no. No, baby, no. Leave. They're pushing you. Tower movement happened already. The truth is coming out maybe next, um, in next uh, 15 days maybe. Leo. Because if you will let this person go, then your right person will come because you are going to be open because it's world is all, look at this, I feel for me it's like all the aces here. Look at this, ace of wand, ace of swords, ace of cup, ace of pentacles. Once you're going to complete the cycle with this person, let this person go. Release this person, release the idea of being with this person and being in love with this person that's not happening. Then you're going to manifest your right person because then you will have a lot of opportunities and possibilities to meet new people. But you're stuck on this person. You're not letting them go with the hangman. You're, you're wasting your time. You're stuck. 
This could be a vice versa energy. This could be a vice versa, like someone is, is, is imagining and dreaming about you, Leo, maybe, if you're not doing, going through this. But it's just a dream. Nothing in reality. The world, the hangman, no, nothing is happening. Nothing. The hangman and the hermit, it's nothing from that person's side. No action, no movement, no contact, nothing. Yeah, no, you hang up. Lengthy, exciting conversation. So you maybe talk to this person. Are you used to talk to this person on social media? But this was just a talking, a flirt. They let you on and you already dreamed uh, and imagined about this person. Uh, this is also someone who may be very talkative on social media. They're active on social media. So you thought maybe this person is talking to you. But in reality, they were talking to, you're not the only one. They were talking to a lot of people. So you maybe think this is, there's a lot of common between me, you, me and this person. Mr. or Mr. Fix It. Yeah, hello, there you go. Mr. or Miss Fix It. Don't try to fix other, the hangman. You're still stuck on this person. Like, oh my God, I will fix this person. No. Don't try to be Mr. or Miss Fix, uh, Leo. Please, you can't fix this person. They're not ready. Money issues. Yeah, look at this Knight of Wands and money issues. This person is focused on their money. They're focused on their building their future, building their career. They, they have a lot of dreams with the wealth card. They even have no idea who you are. Or maybe they have no idea what do you're expecting, what's going on in your mind, and what are you dreaming. They're just far away from you. It's like unreachable, untouchable. This is that type of person here. I don't know whoever from reading for this is very specific reading. Not going to resonate with everyone. But this is just a dream. This is just uh, a someone that you're, you're just imagining, holding, creating the scenarios in your mind, all in your head. In reality, you know that there's nothing. No contact, no conversation. This person never expressed a feeling to you. You never expressed your feeling to this person. Or maybe you did that. You talk to this person, you, you send the messages, you, you thought this person is reading it, but they never replied, they never contacted, they never called you back. Missed opportunity, here you go. I'm so sorry. I don't know whoever from reading for, but it's an eye opening. You need to open your eyes before it's too late for you. This is a missed opportunity. This could be someone that you used to talk and you're still waiting for them, but they, they're not coming back. I'm so sorry. If this is someone from your past, like you were used to live together, you used to talk, you used to hang up, and you're waiting that they will come back. This is your ex or ghosted you or someone. I don't think so. They will come back. I'm so sorry. Missed opportunity. It's like... You are the missed opportunity for this person. Are you are missing the opportunity with new possibilities because you're stuck on and hanging up still on the ex, a past person. With this, um, the world, we have a physical intimacy. Here you go. You can't be together because there's a world different between you and this person. You're, you are definitely uh, not on the same page. This could be also someone. Um, you need to definitely have a healthy, balanced relationship. Someone that you can have a physical intimacy with. And you can't have this physical intimacy with this person. You can't. If this is happening on internet, dating apps, or social media, or whatever this imagining dream, or whatever this celebrity, or whoever this is, person is in your mind. Doing it for the right reason. They are definitely not there present, but you are imagining everything about with this person. Please understand that physical intimacy, physical relationship happen only when it's equal give and take. It's, it's, I don't know, there's something is, is next, next 15 days or end of the January, there's something is, it's like your bubble is going to blow up. Universe is definitely going to happen, this tower movement and telling, pushing you like, go, move, move, open your eyes. Or you maybe already have this tower movement with this person. You know that you need to let them go, but you're still holding on to it. Okay. So this is your reading. I'm going to see you later. Bye. God bless you all.